got up yet. Man, you know all them duck pluckers down there in Tennessee are sleeping, man. You know all them duck pluckers in Tennessee are still sleeping. Audio man, morning time wave got down. I heard all that I did out of Arizona, no doubt. My mind, Big Brother, you got it going on. You definitely got it going on down around Arizona. Good morning time down around Arizona. Audio man, back out. Hey, top afternoon to you too, audio man. You got it going on and coming this way also. <laughs> top afternoon out there, audio man. Ten rides on that there, 105. 105, I got everything back in line like I used to have it before. And I'll tell you what, man, it's nice to be able to uh, <laughs> run my radio room correctly. That's for doggone sure. Hey, keep on with it, keep it on, big brother, while I'm rocking this old Navajo with some a little bit of this doggone hi-fi I got down. Oh, that was good. I heard you, brother, but dang on uh, Jerry Tall Man out there talking about how his wife could let uh, is letting him use the doggone garage for a change. But uh, <laughs> pretty good stuff, pretty good stuff. But uh, yeah, man, um, yeah, I, I like the old school stuff, man. I like the old school stuff. A lot of people said, man, why are you going to direct inject a dog on uh, realistic? I said, because I like the radio. You know, the way it sits right beside the Cobra 2000, it looks real good. I'm uh, getting on down. Big brother, go on, do what you gotta do, man. It's kind of rough and tough all around the doggone edges out there. We just trying to uh, get used to this doggone new sound, man. It sounds a little bit different in uh, my receive and uh, all that than the uh, the Cobra 29 up there. Two uh, two totally different animals, no doubt in my mind. But I do like my 29 as well. That's why that's going to go in my pick em up truck. Ain't no doubt, y'all, the old man got down. Good operator. 